This week we'll be watching my albino Florida king snake eat a mouse. Now, king snakes got their name because they are, in a sense, king of the other snakes because they will often eat other snakes. And surprisingly, they can eat snakes that are even slightly larger than themselves. They will often dine on rattlesnakes in the wild, and because of this, they have evolved the ability to be immune to rattlesnake venom. Of course, in order to eat other snakes, they need to have an advantage of some sort. Experiments have shown that king snakes have higher constriction pressures than most other colubrids like rat snakes. They can squeeze twice as hard as needed in order to kill a rodent, and they need this extra strength in order to overpower snakes. As you can see, they have a very unique coil posture. They will wrap around their prey one to three times, sometimes even a fourth if they're able to, and this helps maximize the force applied to the prey. This comes in particularly handy when the king snake is wrapping around another species of snake. This snake is a little bit derpy. I don't know why she decided to recoil around the mouse, but you know, she's just really excited, so I guess all the power to her. Chad, since I know you're watching this, she is going to be a fun snake for you to feed, but watch your fingers. Florida king snakes are, of course, found in central and southern Florida, where they're often found in sugarcane fields. This species grows to about four to five feet in length, and they live around 15 to 20 years. Sometimes the Florida king snake will interbreed with eastern king snakes in Florida. This is a T negative albino king snake, meaning she lacks functional tyrosinase, which is the enzyme that produces black pigment. This is why she has red eyes. Comparatively, T-positive albino snakes have functional tyrosinase, which is why they have black eyes. So there you go, my temporary albino Florida king snake eating a mouse. In the next few days, she'll be off in her new home, so I figured I'd take advantage and film her while I still had her. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to vote for next week's Feed My Pet Friday, and we'll see you then.